hello everyone so today we are going to implement WSAD movements for this strategy game template we are working on so here now I am pressing D so the camera moves to the right and now I am pressing A camera moves to the left similarly W we move forward and S we move back and also we can rotate the camera and even if I rotate the camera I uh, will be uh, moving same as before relative to the camera's view that we have like this so we had already implemented a uh, moment of the camera when I push the cursor to the edge you can see my camera is also moving also now we can move with WSD as well and everything else is working as same as before all right so before we get started i'd like to remind you you can download the project file so this project and all other thousands of projects that i have done in my channel to the date there are 1700 videos for each video you can access the project files once you become a member in the patreon page without a limit so i'll leave the link in description below and now let's get back to today's video okay so here is our project and at the moment i don't have the wsid moment so the only way to move the camera is using the mouse by pushing to the boundaries so first thing we need in order to implement the moments is a uh, input action so here we have a bunch of actions already and I'll add another one input input action I a move now this is going to be an axis 2d so close now go here under IMC default this means input mapping context here under the mapping add uh, sorry add wait sorry here <laughs> add a new mapping and select ia move why is this keep expanding now here we need to add four keys why is this keep expanding okay i give up so three keys first one is w and then s and then a and then d for the w i'm gonna have to add the modifier this swizzle input because this should make the y value of the axis one and s also i need to add the modifier swizzle input and also another modifier negate that means when i press s i should make y value minus one similarly for a we don't need to do anything or well we need to add a modifier to negate because x value should be minus one for a and d we don't have to do anything because it will automatically be one for x value all right now uh, i in order to control the camera in the game i have actually a dummy character this player pawn this is what i move around the world when i want to move around the camera so i just only have a camera here this camera so in the event graph uh, this uh, already responds to inputs because this is going to be the player character i a moves i a move so now in this action values if i split this i got x value and y value so y value should be used to move forward and x value should be used to move to the sides for that 
under triggered at moment input now the direction in order to use the x value i can get the camera and get right vector and from this right vector uh, we don't need the z component so let's make a vector using only x and y component the reason that i don't need z component is i want the camera character to move in horizontal plane and let's normalize this then give it as the word direction and the value would be this x value similarly we this is for the side moment for the y value i can do the same thing but here get forward vector split and x y right now the scale value is y that's pretty much it now let's see see i'm moving forward and backward and left and right and also if i rotate the camera still my movements are working in the way you expect all right so everything else is still working uh, i can't select these red actors because they are not from my team so yeah this is all i wanted to do for today implementing wsd moments for the strategy controller template that we were working on don't forget to like and subscribe thanks for watching so as always updated project files will be available for the download in patreon page feel free to let me know what else i should cover in this strategy series see you in the next episode goodbye